it together. We gotta get his mic fixed, man. This says transmit. That's how we figured out Chris's wasn't working. Uh, a TX light? Yeah. Is that what you're talking about? I think. Alright, every time you push the button down, that little signal strength that looks like a cell phone tower should light up. It is nothing. Okay, well then that's your microphone's bad at the at the uh at the, at the base. Or whatever. Yeah. There it goes. When I, there it goes. Yeah. Can you hear me? You're not on. Right? Yeah. Chris is did. He was the same thing. Like he could somehow he had to push the button and wiggle it or something for it to yeah, work. If I hold mine down for an extra. It's working now. Yeah. I don't know what. There must be those mics. I don't know. But Chris did the exact same thing. Should have got one with the fax machine on it, man. No. <laughs> I wonder if they'll replace it. Did Chris have to buy another one? I think he did. Cause he was bitching about the. Paying seventeen dollars for shipping and handling. <laughs> the guy I met at Kroger was like, "What radios do you run?" I was like, "Rugged." He's like, "Man, those are so expensive." Yeah, and not worth it. I was like, you know, that's there's, my there's fault. Nothing else that. Can yeah, the the it, the waterproof is the biggest thing. Like, you can get a cheap CB, but that was the only one I could find that was waterproof. Yeah. Allie, you holding up over there? He said, are you holding up? Yeah. You want to get the car seat? No. <laughs> no? Is it not, is it too bumpy? Yeah. The car seat might help, won't it? She, she likes the slower stuff, that's for sure. Yeah. If I had Levi here with me, he'd be like, go, go, go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll head back, get you some gas. Yeah, I'm all right. I mean, I, I don't care. Let's go. Let's go get gas, and then uh, okay. go over to Jeep Part One. Okay. I want to see Slippery Nipple. Okay. I'm probably gonna get out. It's not bad. Slippery Nipple is nothing. I don't like uh, it. There's one or two parts of, of the hill climbs over there that are look tricky. Have you ever taken the swamp loop there? Uh. To the Jeep Park One. You talking about where you cut in where you're not supposed to? No, I would never do that. <laughs> no, you cross, you cross the swamp. Yeah. And then you turn left, and there's a trail that takes you from there to like the bottom of those the second set of hills. You'll be like 200 feet away from Slippery Nipple, where it comes out. Yeah, but they always have a rope there, and I can't ever get through it. I'll let you lead. I've never had a rope there. All right, well, you you lead and we'll we'll go that way back. Or no, we, we need to go back first. Yeah, we can do. I don't care. We can we can go. It'll make it interesting. That's for sure. It's been a long time since. So we'll take a look at the swamp, and no. and and judge it from there. No, no, no. Because I, I, I. We have to go that way anyway. We don't have to go around the swamp to get there, do we? Or is that the way you're talking about? Um, you go straight through, you cross through the, the swamp. You know, there's two entrances to the swamp. Yeah, Not like, like if you come up, crossing, like if you come down, you pass Monster Mountain, turn right down Q. No, I'm not talking about that. That's Swamp Loop. Then you go around, then you connect into Swamp, and you go all the way to the back there where that bridge is. Where the bridge is? The little bridge over the, uh... Running where they put a pipe in, there's like a little bridge where you flip yeah. one time. Yeah. Go back that way and then go around the swamp that way. Yeah. I had never been that way, no. Yeah. Let's go get gas and we'll check it out. Okay. <laughs>
first, buddy. You're gonna go through that?
not, you're not good. Nah, it's just got water in the radiator, uh, radiator. It was fine, it didn't hurt it. <laughs> He's trying to convince her.
dry as a bone out there everywhere today. A little coughing right here is tough, but the next one's tougher, I'm not sure. It's been a long time since I've been here. Do you understand that? Man, that stuff stinks. His tires are a whole lot better for mud than these are. Quicksand here. When you fall off the trail? Yeah. 